Hello everyone, I've got a Dollar Tree haul, and here comes Kitty, you better get back there or something. There's not much room, Kitty. You lay right there. Anyway, I just got one thing frozen. I didn't get anything refrigerated, so I'm just going to show it. This, it's a Michelina's Cheesy Chicken and Rice Bake. So, I'll put that up. I'll be right back. Okay, uh... Yeah, we I did a, a out and about with Mike and Joy, which you'll see before this. And we went to a, a little independent car repair shop. Uh, that guy said there's he he pushed up he pushed up and down on every above every tire and uh you know on the body of the car. And he said if the struts were bad, it would like after you push it down, it would come up and it would keep bouncing like this. And not one of, not one place did that, that he checked. And he said, there's nothing wrong with your struts. So that was a real relief. Um, just goes to show some of these places that work on uh, cars, they'll, they'll take you. I mean, so always get a second opinion. That's what we did. And we're really glad we did because it's not making the noise. Ever since they changed the oil, which I don't think that had anything to do with it, it, they rotated all the tires, so they had to take all the tires off and put them in a you know different spot. Uh, ever since they did that, we never heard the noise again. So uh, he said, "Oh, well, I knocked something over." He said, "If it starts to make the noise again, to bring it back to him." But he said, "I'm not going to charge you for something that doesn't need fixed." So that's honest. So that's where we'll be taking our car whenever it does need any kind of repairs to this guy because he seems really honest. So anyway, we stopped by a Dollar Tree. You probably saw that in the uh, video. Uh, I was pretty much out, or we, uh, Logan and I were pretty much out of all chip type products or anything, you know, snacks very much. We didn't have hardly anything left for his show, just a few bags of different kinds of chips. Uh, so I needed to stock up, and Dollar Tree is the best place to do it because uh, you don't have to buy a, a big, huge bag of it. And we don't, you know, we don't. A lot of times we don't want a big bag of something. Lay down, lay down. Okay, so here's one. I keep. I've always bought the little. Uh, I mean, the uh, cheese puffs that are stubs, but I don't think I've ever tried the chips. So I got one of those. Needed some crackers. It's not bad for $1.25 if they're any good. Um, got one Crunch and Munch Caramel. Kitty, your fur. Crunch and Munch Caramel. Hold on just a minute. Okay. We got these. This is one of the new brands they've got there. Chicago American. It's Chicago Caramel and Cheddar Popcorn. So that's definitely one of the newer ones I got. And I've never seen these. I, they have hers chips. Or hers. Hers chips. This one's tortilla, hint of lime. Tortilla chips. I'm stocked up now for a while. That's the best place to get stuff to try because you don't have to buy the big bag. I may have already said that. Uh, Utz Popcorn White Cheddar Cheese. I couldn't remember if we tried that one. Uh, Wise Ridgies Sour Cream and Onion. Oh, okay. Utz Onion and Garlic Chips. And the California style barbecue. Carolina, not California. Carolina, I need my glasses on. Uh, we got the So Natural freeze dried mixed fruit. We've had some of the others. I think we had strawberry and something else uh, in these, but we never have had done, done the mixed fruit. Uh, Joy got her one of these. How's it? Does it open bigger than that? Oh, let's push that in. You push, 
how you pull this out and it'll stay like that. So that's pretty neat. Okay. Got Rudolph's. I've never seen that brand there. If I did, I, I didn't ever buy any of it. Onion, onions, or onions, onion flavored greens. Snyder's pretzel sticks. Chicken crackers. These are really good with cheese. Really good. And they're about as good as the brand, brand name of those. The chicken and a biscuit. Uh, got a couple of these power stick. Uh, what is it? It's the 3.5 ounce bonus size. Power stick. This one's cool. All day fresh body spray. Cool blast. And this one is intensity those are a pretty good that's a pretty good price because the axe ones are really expensive they're like five bucks for a little can like that and they had some um some juniors coffee y'all if you've never tried this it is really really good it's good coffee and it's really not a bad uh, deal because uh, four ounces is a dollar twenty-five, and I got four of them, so that's sixteen ounces for five dollars. Uh, a regular brick of coffee is usually like eleven point five ounces or something like that, so that's a good deal, I think. You know, so I got four of those. Two, three, and four. I really like that coffee. We all do. Really good. They also had the Harry and David, which we tried before, and it's good too, but we like the juniors the best. Okay. Uh, I got these Zaps uh, Mesquite Barbecue Kettle Style Chips to try. And um, this or organic. Chicago uh, American, that same brand, organic sea salt popcorn. I don't know if we tried that one before now. And I got these to try the mini snack bites, tomato and oregano. That was kind of neat. And I got this to try either on Logan's show one day or, or a taste test with Mike. It's uh, Tapatio. Am I saying that right again? I, I know I have. I mispronounced that before. Tapatio, I think. Uh, mac and cheese. It says it's hot. We'll see. That's interesting. I got this to try on morning coffee break one day. It's Welch's 100% vitamin C orange pineapple juice. And... Joy got her an energy drink, rip it, and it was cherry lime. Um, we got this. If y'all have never tried these, they're really good, and I add extra cheddar cheese to it. Extra, you hear that? That's a, a warning. We're having some severe weather coming in. There's a tornado warning and everything, so that's what that loud noise is. It's a warning on TV. Uh, but these Pillsbury cheddar garlic biscuit mix are really good. Just add milk. And then I add some, like I said, some shredded uh, shredded cheddar to it. We got these for Logan. Uh, they're Cocoa Crispy Cereal Straws. Chocolatey Crunchy Snack for Milk Sipping Fun. Five of them in there. And... That he didn't find them, which I'm surprised. But I got her one thing of these purr sticks, Vitacraft purr sticks, chicken recipe, fresh, meaty, and soft. I don't know if the other ones we bought her there before they were the same thing, but I don't know if they were chicken or not. And she ate them. I cut them up with scissors for. Her. But she likes these. I don't. But I'm I'm thinking that it might be chicken, chicken that she likes. That's the only flavor they had in them, but three of them in there, and they're pretty good size. They're, they're thicker than the ones that we get at Kroger. Okay, that's all that. I got this cute little pillow thing. 
It says Harvest Blessings, and it's got the truck on it. I thought that was neat. Matter of fact, why is it doing the light like that? Okay. Take a. I was trying to get it to where. I'll do it this way. I was going to see if I could enlarge that somehow and. see if I can get it. That's cute. I don't know. I just thought it was cute. Um, I got some of their uh, facial tissue. Uh, they didn't have any kind of bonus buys on the um, toilet paper and it was just not, it's not worth it. It's, there's not hardly anything on those rolls they got right now to, to make it worth even $1.25. Uh, but whenever I see they have a bonus one, you know, that has, the other one had 300 sheets or something like that instead of 240 now that's much better you know because you got uh, in a four rolls it would be another uh 240 it's just like getting an extra roll really um these are the big value tissues this is the ones you need to look for because they got 175 uh, of them in it and they're not too bad and i got four of those they had a bunch of movies, y'all. Um, we just got so many of them. Um, this is a Blu-ray. The Last Warrior. That looks good. And this one is Wolves. Jason Momoa is in this one. It doesn't say on the front of this one who's in it. So I can't, I don't have my... Glasses on to look for wolves. This one's Ghosts of War. I need my glasses, I guess. I'm trying to see if there's anybody in it. I know it. I don't know. Billy Zane is in it. Okay, this one is Shark Knight. From the director of Final Destination, Shark Knight, and House at the End of the Street with uh, Jennifer Lawrence in it, from Hunger Games, I guess. Um, got some uh, chocolate-covered raisins. I don't think that's to try, though. I think she just got those for Logan. And Joy got some of these jaw clip, or a jaw clip, I guess. And they didn't have, they had the boost uh, drinks, but they didn't have any chocolate. And I couldn't remember, I know I tried the chocolate, and I was actually just wanting one, you know, to, to use, to uh, drink. Um, but I can't remember if I tried the vanilla or not on morning coffee break. Can you, any of y'all remember, did I try the vanilla? already or I think it was just chocolate maybe or something I think they had a it seemed like it was a caramel one or something like that I, I can't remember but I thought I would try one of these if I haven't already and I got one for Logan as well um, got some chocolate sea salt caramels this is one of the new ones too landmark Conf confection one of the newer ones they've got brands so that sounds good i feel decent size too okay this is the rest of the i don't think there's anything else in this the rest of the uh facial tissue and they had the bonus buy on the uh paper towels instead of 140 sheets it's got 176 sheets 25 percent more always look for that there at a dog shape so i got two of those i didn't need them real bad but that's a good buy so i went ahead and got a couple and we got some of these this, i guess 25 percent bonus it says plus 25 percent product here it is 25 plus 25 percent product so it's 25 percent more it's Mezada corn tostadas. 
saw a bad price on that. And I broke, well, I didn't break it, it just broke. They're, they're, uh, have y'all had any problem with their uh, glass uh, cups and stuff like that? And these little mug-like things? Um, this is like the third one that's that we've had broke. Not at just this size. I mean, a, a couple other different, you know, different styles. Um, they all seem to break real easy. The whole, the bottom, uh, the bottom part broke off of it the other day. And we, uh, I mean, it was in the sink being washed. Uh, and, uh, you know, stuff gets kind of knocked around a little bit, but not enough to break something. I mean, uh, so I got another one. If this doesn't last any time, I'm not getting any more. So. so, okay, that's it. So we got quite a bit of stuff, but like I said, we were in, in real need of getting some uh, things to try on Logan's Awesome Snack Reviews. And I would much rather, you know, like I said, get them at, I'd much rather get them at Dollar Tree. And that way, I only got a dollar twenty-five in it. And some of these big bags of, of chips just cost a lot these days. So, um, like I said, this is the best way to try it. And then, um, Walmart does carry Uts in bigger bags. So if you were to, uh, if we were to try one of them we really liked, we might be able to get it at Walmart in a bigger bag. But like I said, it's perfect for us to try things in these size bags instead of having a lot of. Uh, left stuff, uh, chips left over because we really don't eat that many uh, chips. I mean, we eat a few. I might have a sandwich or something for lunch, and I'll have a few chips or uh, <coughs> excuse me, <coughs> maybe at night I might have a handful sometimes, but not not very many. So we we try not to have so many big bags, you know, laying around from from trying them on Logan's show. But anyway, I hope y'all enjoyed this Dollar Tree haul. It's been quite a while. I'm trying to think if we even went last month. Seems like we didn't. Uh, it's been quite a while, like I said, since we've been there. I think there's a real good buys on the uh, movies especially. They've got some names in them you've heard of before. So anyway, I hope y'all enjoyed this Dollar Tree haul. If you did, I hope you'll press that like button. Also subscribe if you haven't already and share this out. And hit that so you get all my videos as soon as they come out. All right, everybody. Hope you have a great day. This I would call this a huge or massive Dollar Tree haul. For us, it is. It's a lot of stuff. So, But I'm real happy with what we got that we're stocked up for the next quite a few shows on Logan's. So, everybody, I hope you have a great day. And we'll see you later on. God bless.